Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. The morning is already chaotic. I am pumping. Baby girl is sleeping. I had to switch her to a new Gentle Ease formula last night because I feel like the one that I've been using is one, making her stomach hurt and um yeah it's making her gassy basically and like spit up so i'm like you know what i have the gentle ease let's just switch to the gentle ease and see how it works so we're trying that out right now so um i bought these shelves yesterday right now i have all types of throw blankets on the couch and all types of water bottle yesterday joe came over to meet her goddaughter for the first time because her girl was in jamaica living her best life the entire time so she came over to meet her goddaughter and um we were just here with the kids we ended up going to we went to the dollar tree we went to d2 because she's never gone to a d2 store before and she wanted to try it out and when i went to d2 let's actually go mount the shelves on the wall I put one more shelf up. This is the one with Mia Jade on there. And I wanted to put one more there between it and the white one, but I don't think it's between those two, but I don't think it's going to look symmetrical and that really is going to bother me. So we're going to leave it like that for now. If I end up putting one and changing that one around, because I might just put this one in the middle, move it up a little bit, put it in the middle and put the other little clear one right up there. Right? So I'll have to see. But this is what the living room on the couch is looking like right now. So I'm going to straighten it up a little bit. But I love how the blankets that I've chosen gives it some color. There's a white one right there. I When I went to D2, I bought some curtains. They're right there. So basically I bought the same tweed looking ones, the tan looking ones over here to put on that window. So let's see. Alright guys, so um, right now I'm trying to pump. Well, I'm actually pumping. The 30 minutes is already done. I just started it back a second time. Hold on. I just checked on me. I'm not even going to change the curtains at the moment. I can't be bothered to do that right now. And I have an appointment for her at 10 15 and I have to get there by 10 7 o'clock right now. So I'm basically gonna have three hours I'm Pretty sure So I need to make some breakfast and stuff like that we're gonna Make some breakfast eat so that when it's almost time I can just start getting her ready and we're we're gonna be ready to go I think I'm gonna take her in her carrier as opposed to the stroller Yesterday she was wilding out when we went on the road just in terms of like she was just not having a good day yesterday honestly and like i said it's because i feel like one she's gassy and two she was just yesterday wasn't her best day i'll tell you that so we're gonna bring her in the carrier where she's closer to me because yesterday when i went in one of the stores i ended up having to take her out and just hold her a little bit just to give her a little bit of comfort she didn't sleep the best yesterday in the day so now when she's sleeping we're taking it i think almost five 4.5 finish yeah so yesterday she wasn't really having the best day so luckily I had gone on the NFML website prior to having her and I signed up and so I had gotten these as like samples i got the gentle ease the regular one another one another one so the gentle ease says that it's good the gentle ease neuropro says that it's good for it's designed to help reduce crying in 24 hours and i think uh, it does say for fussiness crying gas and spit up and i think she's gassy and she's spitting up 
She cries occasionally. She's not a bad baby, but the gassing and the spitting up is what I mainly see. So now that we've pumped, we're going to put the pump parts in the fridge, put the milk in the fridge. Yesterday I went to the Dollar Tree and bought some aluminum foil because I like to put those on my stove. So when it's time to clean it, I could just, oh my God, man, Mr. Made, I think spaghetti and meatball or whatever. And I can see tomato paste or tomato sauce on the stove and it's stressing me out. I but that's another one of the things that I don't have the bandwidth to deal with right at the moment because I already have enough going on. I'm already doing more than I'm supposed to be doing right now. Yesterday I went to the Dollar Tree and I saw these and I got more of the blue ones because I really do favor the blue ones. They taste better. I really need to start drinking that because I feel like my supply is kind of diminishing because you know what? Yesterday I didn't really pump much, but yesterday I was basically, I had her on the boob basically the whole day because for her normally she's like a little bit cranky or a little bit all over the place i try to put her on the boob just to give her a little bit of comfort because that is the only way i know to comfort her and if she's stressed out and i don't know what's going on then i need to give her some comfort so i was giving her the boob for most of the day so i didn't really pump much and that's why what i got from the pumping is not much right now even though she's been sleeping since 11 p.m and she didn't wake up until 5 12 1 2 3 five that's six hours but she was fed nicely before she went down but i'm realizing for the last like four days or so that her her um the night sleep is getting a little bit longer at first it went from two hours to three then to four then to five last night she slept for six hours you know and when she woke up i better have had that bottle ready which i did because she slept for so long so i had it ready for her and gave it to her and that was great so now um yeah, she's back down for her first nap of the day. Let's put some milk in the pitcher. Yeah, so she's down for her first nap of the day. And so this is a time where I'm going to try to get myself together, make myself some breakfast and do a lot of the things. Because while the appointment isn't supposed to be too long, um, I just want to make sure that I've eaten and all of that. Might even take a little trip to the mall. Or maybe I'll wait until her dad comes home from work and I will leave them too. And, um, no, you know what? I'm not going to go to the mall because if I go to the mall, I'm going to spend money. I'm not going to do that. So we're going to just run our errands and come home and I don't want to spend money right now. I was going to make some breakfast, but then I remember that last night Joe and I went to Subway to get the girls something to eat and we ended up getting something to eat as well. So I got the sandwich that I normally get during my pregnancy. I'm surprised that I still like it. I'm gonna put an avocado on there because yesterday I had some Target same day delivery too. I specifically had it for a shower gel that I saw on TikTok. And I bought it because I'm working on my hyperpigmentation and that is exactly what it's for. And um, I ended up buying some avocado, some banana because I really do like bananas and avocados. And what else did I get? Some bread. So that's all we have. So we're gonna eat that with some avocado. Put the rest of the avocados in the fridge. Um, try to get myself together. I need to make some coffee. I think I already did the water. Yep. So we are going to make a little bit of coffee. I think I'm going to do iced coffee because it's hot. I haven't been drinking coffee as much since I had her. I mean, I did cut down on my, cons on my consumption when I was pregnant just because I had to for the pregnancy. But since then, I did not like start drinking more or anything. So normally I just mix my coffee in like a little warm water first. I use condensed milk. Condensed milk. And it's easier to mix the condensed milk in warm mixture than it is to mix it in cold. And then I add my creamer. I love this creamer. And then we'll add the water. I'm gonna warm the sandwich we're going to eat that for breakfast and then um, I'm going to just take a few minutes myself to get myself together, figure out what I'm going to wear, figure out what she's, I already know what she's going to wear. I just need to take it out, figure out what I'm going to wear and get that together so that when it's time to go, I might even just get ready and just chill out a little bit until she's ready, even though that's a long time. But I'm wearing comfortable clothes anyways. I'm literally wearing leggings on the top because... That is the uniform these days. It's the easiest thing to jump into. So, um, yeah. So, I'm going to eat. 
get myself together and that really is all there is to do right at the moment I really might move those shelves around because that one really is bothering me my OCD is screaming inside of me right now so I might do that if I find that I have a little bit of time but I'm gonna prioritize getting something to eat and like getting myself together because the buns are back at least for now I mean I don't really know how long that's gonna last for because honestly right in this moment I'm really struggling to do my hair I feel like my pregnancy somehow made it thicker and fuller especially in the middle and so it's really difficult for me especially when I'm washing it normally washing it is an easier time and then everything else is what I can be bothered with but at this point I would take it being easy to wash it over what I'm currently experiencing because I just cannot so we have a little kind of low bun going right now and I have that for <coughs> yesterday the day before last two days now I need to take my vitamins for sure I also had my six-week doctor's appointment today but her dad ended up switching his shift with somebody else so he's coming home later so I need to call my doctor's office actually to see if I can reschedule that appointment for either later today or tomorrow maybe we'll do tomorrow if I can get an appointment if not it's gonna have to be next week because we're trying to do it for when um, he's home so that I don't have to take her with me so yeah we're gonna have to see so I have my I'm gonna call you back like the girls are saying these days I'm gonna enjoy some breakfast and take my vitamins and like I said you know just enjoy a few minutes of myself check on Tuki I'm gonna also pop her pacifier in her mouth again just to give her a little bit of comfort I'm sorry that for breakfast cannot be healthy see how it's not whatever I'm gonna call you back for real I'm done with breakfast I'm also filming a little basically day in the life for TikTok I've started documenting it on my Insta stories already but it's so much easier to put it on Instagram because I'm doing it in real time while TikTok is gonna get it at the end of the day and um oh I might put it on here as shorts ice coffee still full but I brought my Mac out here so I could do some light editing at the table. You know what? We'll do it in the living room. But she's going off. Like I said, I noticed yesterday she's not sleeping as much. This morning I made her a bottle of the Gentle Ease. I'm gonna... Let me see how long she's been sleeping for. Right, guys i'm going to leave y'all here again i just found or outfits for us to wear i'm gonna just pop it on the screen here i'm pretty sure i have a video of it in my phone because i can't go back there right now and i'm gonna finish up some things here